episode 39 begins now. Hello everyone, this is Argon Matrix, and we're back with more R Mario RPG. So last time we pretty much explored all of Monster Monstro Town, but off screen I did something that I didn't really intend to do. I talked to this guy a bunch and he says a bunch of different lines. That's his last one right there, he just keeps repeating it. Don't you do these vibes. But I talked to him apparently enough times and I you head outside and that's how you get the key down actually. So, uh, that's the temple key. I'm not sure what that's exactly for. Probably something in Balloon Temple, I think. Oh, wait, wait, wait. That's where- Oh my god. Is that how you get past the Golden Balloon statue? Oh, he said he wanted a key. Let me, well, let's get that. Hell, I thought, like, all those things that were behind that were just taunting you and there actually was no key. Didn't remember that there actually was. Holy balls. Oh my god. Okay, so, we just need to head out- Wait. Hmm. Yeah, he's so hungry. Of course he is. Okay. Now. Yeah, he's not accepting visitors, so let's go visit him. Yeah. Oh, my greedy ass starting off the episode by doing this. That key you have there looks pretty tasty. Give him the key or keep the key? Give it to him. I have nothing to lose. Nom, nom, nom. And he dies. So let's see what we have here. Found a max mushroom. Yeah, that's pretty good. I'll get rid of this mushroom for it. And we have, um, a royal syrup, which is also very good. Get rid of the honey syrup for that. Why do I still have a freaking honey syrup? Oh my god. Got like a million frog coins here. Holy crap, that's a ton. Uh, get, oh my god, get the frog coin. And another item. A fire bomb. Eh, that's not really useful. I never use any of the bombs, so let's just get rid of it. And we got some flowers here, which is cool. Oh, why does I have to pause every one? Takes too much time. Okay, well that's a nice little fun way to start off the episode. Off to a great start here. But now let's actually, we're going to have to progress through the game now. So, let's just try and get him to be hungry again so we can get back to Monstro Town. Okay, come on, dude. I know you want some snacks. I mean, you're so fat. There we go. Uh, it usually takes like two or three tries to, well usually actually just three in order to get that message that he's hungry, so. I've never gotten it on the first try, I don't think. And back out to Monstro Town. And now that we're out here, we can go to this area, this so-called Bean Valley that we want to check out now. Because that's apparently where the star piece, or the path to the star piece is. So Bean Valley is that little circle up there by the plant pot, but we have to go through Land's End to get to there. So I'm probably just going to cut this to a certain point. I'm going to cut to the Sky Bridge, remember that mini game where we just kept falling off? Yeah, I'm going to cut to there, so see ya. Alrighty, so we're back over on the other side of the Sky Bridge. Uh, you don't actually have to do the mini game to get past there, but I, and I didn't, so I didn't, I also didn't like get any levels or anything. Okay, this is the area that I'm supposed to go to, is it not? Oh, it probably isn't. I'm probably making an ass of myself now. Well, concern it. Oh, no, wait, you're supposed to follow the ant. That's right, crap. I'm gonna have to go through this Shogun thing again. Okay, but you guys don't want to see that, do you? No, probably not. So, I'm just gonna cut that. Or, well, maybe if we don't get into any fights, I'll show this whole thing. But... I find it highly unlikely that we'll go through this whole thing without fighting it. Or maybe you don't fight them after you've done it once, I don't know. I think this is the area that we want to go. Yep, right here. There's all the troopers. Wow, that's a giant cluster. Clusterfuck. Ten hut. All troops in position. Mario, your, pos your mission is to scale the cliff by jumping shell to shell. Alright. No big deal. Just gotta get our jumping accuracy perfect, which is easy in this game, right? Yeah, for sure. Alright, so let's start climbing to the top. Alright, oh, these things move? Okay, I forgot that. Shows how much I know. Alright, and up here, and down here. Oh, crap! Oh my god! No! Oh, that was bullshit. Don't give up. Sure and steady does it. Now, I can try now go and try again. Okay, let's do it. Do it for real this time. This is the really... Oh my god. Hey, if this takes too long enough to cut some of this... Though I don't want to get too overzealous with the cutting. Oh, oh my god. <clears throat> Keep hitting my head on that one shell. Stupid isometric view. Well, it's not isometric, it's just 
the most random perspective viewpoint that you can possibly have. Probably the hardest to work with, too. And over back here. And it should just carry me up there like that. Perfect. How did I do? The last time is 15 seconds, 3 milliseconds. Not bad for a civilian. Uh, I think there's some rewards to get through doing this. Um, oh, where's that? Is that going to be in the minigame section here? Oh, dear. Booster. Hit Sky Ridge. Scale the cliff. Here we go. All right. Uh, if you make it to the top of the hill in under 14 seconds, you have a 33.3% chance of netting a frog coin. The first time you make it under 12 seconds, you win a Troopa pin. If you make it up to 11, under 11 minutes, 11 seconds, 49 milliseconds, it will be guaranteed a frog coin. Make it under 11 seconds, and you'll win 5 frog coins. I see. So, those are some of the rewards you can get. Um, I might want to get that Troopa pin. That sounds kind of interesting. Yeah, I'm going to go for it, so I'll be right back. How fast was that? Last time is 12 seconds and 80 milliseconds. That's quite good. Here's a little something from me. Oh, so that's the 33.3% chance of the frog coin there. I guess I'll show that off as one of the rewards. Alright, that had to be fast. Twel oh my god. That's quite good. Here, keep up the great work. Oh no, no frog coin for me. Eleven seconds, sixty-three milliseconds. Distinguishing work, soldier. Here's the next best thing: a trooper pin. Cool. Now, what does the trooper pin do exactly? Let's find out. I mean, hell. Okay, trooper. Oh, I didn't even clip. No, wait. I. Yeah, the hurly gloves are worse than the spike -like. Never mind. Okay, the troop. Wait, what does it do? Grant trooper confidence. Okay. Okay, so it's bad for Mario. It's bad for Gino. So let's just not bother with that at all. Okay, that's just for the completion of it then. And I think, yep, with that we made it to Bean Valley. Damn it, and I forgot to start my timer back up. Crap. Okay, so here's Bean Valley. Very autumn-ish color scheme. And I think pretty much all the enemies around here are the same as in Land's End, so there's really nothing new to show off. I don't know, but there might be like one or two new, um, new things around, but for the most part, I'm just going to cut these battles out. I mean, obviously, I'll leave that one in because I talked through the whole thing. What the hell? Oh, look at that. Looks like Peach we just gained another level. So, um, oh, I forgot what level she starts at. I'll just go, like, 10, 11, right, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Okay, HP. Works for me. Alright, I don't know my way through Bean Valley really at all, but, oh wait, I should look up any hidden chests here so that I don't have to go back and get them like I did last time because that was just annoying as freak. Oh, it looks like there's only one. And it's not in this area, so I'll just move. Move on, move on. Um, that's a great area. Okay. And, oh, these guys respawn? Crud. No, oh, almost got me, but not quite good enough. So there's that one that contains a, uh, well, a frog coin, obviously. Why, are, why did some of these contain frog coins, not like items and whatever, stuff that could be useful, potentially. Because I'm not going to use, like, too many of these frog coins later on in the game. I might use some of them, because there's some good items you can get with the frog coins. But for the most part, they're actually just useless and kind of fun to collect. Okay. So, uh, is this the area I want? Let's see. There's a shy way up there and some random prong plants here. Let's take this one. Is this the right one that I want? Oh, hello. Hey there, piranha plant. How you doing, big guy? Oh, chewies. I don't think I've seen these guys before. And they're pretty freaking weak, and not even going to use, like, any weakness on them. There, you're dead. Ha ha. Okay. And, uh, maybe I'll go down the pipe now. Let's see. Oh, what's down here? Oh, yeah, I... Oh. Hmm. Oh, my God. No. Well, I got a flower or something. I don't know. I don't even. I don't know if I even got anything there. Okay, which one of these can I fight now? Come on, give me some. Give me some. I'll just fight the shy way. Okay. Let's do this. Oh, hello. What are you? A right ribite? I have a feeling that I've already seen this guy, but yeah. Let's leave the battle in because 
You know, I've already talked this far into it. Ooh, a lucky. Okay. Uh, oh, I should really get around to using the mystery egg, shouldn't I? Willy West. No! Ah, crap. Why do I keep saying crop instead of like crap? Crap! And not enough. Okay, the robot's not really too th too threatening. I mean, just look at his face. How can he be threatening at all? Jeez. And he's not dead. Oh my god. Just die already. Thank you. Alright, is there any point of fighting that shy way? Oh, double my XP points? Sure. Why not? Haven't done one of these in a while. And where's Yoshi? Right there. Perfect. 16 XP. Cool. Alright, which one do you use real now? Come on. Or which one he wants to grow. I want more items from these chat from these things, I'm telling you. Okay, let's just wait. Let's just wait. Wait patiently. Screw this, I'm cutting. Okay, so obviously you don't want to kill this shy away, because he's the one who brings these things to life. I am sorry about that, guys. I did not know that. And these are all similar enemies. Whatever. Alright, that battle was actually rather annoying, so let's see if it was even worth it. Come on, big money, big money. Ooh, there's a big room here. Oh, crap. Well, here's a box boy. I guess it is technically a new enemy, so let's just take it on. I'd imagine it's weak to the jump, just like everything else. Or all the other renditions of this enemy, I should say. That was a lot of bounces. That wasn't 30, I know that much, but that was... I think I broke my record of 13 there. Whoa! Um... No, I'm not settling for that. Let's go ahead and use a pick-me-up. Because Gino could be crucial to this fight, you never know. These fights can go anyway. What the? Monsters are inside. Hello, um... Foutso. <laughs> Foutso. Fatso is more like it. I know that's what the word is playing on, but... Still. Alright. You die. Now. You. Stupid. Gray. Fucking. Box. Boy. I. Don't. Know. What. Else. To say. Okay, it's dead. Thanks for that. Now let's kill the fout so. Before it kills us. With its. Random. Dog. Mouse. Face. Whatever. I don't know. This thing is ugly as hell. So. I just want to take him out. He also looks really smug or arrogant or something. Oh, oh, come on. What the? Ow. Oh my god, Mario's almost dead. Well, we should do something about that, shouldn't we? Probably. Okay, right after this turn. Oh, dear. Give him a max mushroom peach. I don't see why not. Wait, actually, no, what the, what the hell are you doing? I'll just give him a... Uh, Mid mushroom. No, not not on yourself, you. Oh my god, you greedy bitch. Okay, now he's gonna kill Mario, I know it. Oh. That was a very peaceful attack. Oh shit. Um. This is bad. This is really bad. Okay. Someone, come back. Mario, come back to life. Let's do this. And. And oh, I pulled off the action command. Perfect. Hey, ow! D damn. Okay. Peach, your job is now keeping Mario alive while he takes care of the fout. So, jeez, is this turning into a boss fight or something? I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna have to look up this guy's weakness just, just in case I actually have it. Okay, where is he? Fouto. Fouto. Oh, he's weak to jump and ice. Oh my god, he's weak to jump. That would have been great for me to look at earlier. Obviously, I'm stupid. Okay. So, let's just go ahead and jump on him like we do on everything else in the world. Oh my god, that looks painful. Dear. Oh no! Shoot. Well, finish him off with the super jump, Mario. Let's do it. On. Oh my god, he's dead. Yes, okay. I thought he kind of like paused there for a minute before making him die. And Mario reached level 17, which is great. 
So 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Perfect. Beautiful. Right now we should probably heal up. Okay, um, yeah, we'll use special. Come on, Peach, use that therapy yours on yourself and on Gino. And now, yeah, I guess I'll, just, I'll use an item. Why not? That mid mushroom on Peach was kind of wasted, but yeah, whatever. All right, oh enemies. I see one more enemy up here at least. You know, let's let's avoid these guys. So that was a very pointless area, except for the level up, I suppose. Oh, cool. And that frog coin, I guess there is a, I guess there's a silver lining to every pipe. All right. Um, and I'll tackle one more pipe before the video ends, I guess. We've got like 30 seconds left until 15 minutes here. Okay. So here's one. All right. Oh, this is an easy fight. There's two of these chewies. No problem. Even with my very limited time now, I can still take these guys out and have time to spare. Right. Uh, oh my god, Mallow, you have to level up now. Okay. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Wow, I should have known that. Mario just leveled up. Well, whatever. Okay. I need to stop stretching these episodes for so long. This is crazy. Oh, okay, so there's three enemies, three li these Gekkets, and a Golden Chomp. So we'll take on these things maybe in the next episode. Thank you everyone for watching, and until next time, this is Argon Matrix signing out. Thank you, and good night.